If you have ever tried building AI powered apps, you know the pain, right? Even before you start writing the first line of code, you're already jiggling up between the developer accounts, API keys, documentations, authentication, and by the time you set up everything, the excitement is gone. But today, that all changes because Rapid launched something massive and it's called AI integrations. And honestly, right now, this might be the fastest way to go from an idea to a working app in minutes. No setup, no API keys, and no switching tools. Just open Replit, choose the model, and you're all good to go. And the crazy part, Replit now gives you access to well over 300 plus AI models right from your workspace itself, including GPT-5, GPT-4.0, Cloud 4.5 Sonnet, Cloud Opus, DeepSea, Quen, you name it. You can access all these models right from your workspace itself. Plus, connectors in Replit makes it easy to connect your apps to external tools and services or data sources in just a single click. So no more wiring or OAuth flows or managing API keys. So you want to integrate something like Dropbox, you can literally sign in and boom, you're building on top of it. It's that simple. And all of these combined turns your Replit workspace into an ultimate AI playground where you can build anything like a customized chatbot, internal tools, knowledge assistance, storytelling apps, design tools, dashboard, transcription tools, or even full-fledged MVPs. And that is exactly what I'm going to show you in today's video. So let's quickly get started. So this right here is Replit. And again, I don't really have to introduce Replit to you guys because you guys are already aware of the same. And for starters, if you want to access Replit, all you have to do is to click the first link in the description below and head over to replit.com and you can go ahead and sign up for a new account. And once you create your account, this is going to be the kind of interface that you will see. And this is the workspace where all the magic happens. And as you can see, towards the center, you can find an input box. And all you have to do is to just explain your app idea or whatever tool that you want to build in this input box right here. And you can click on the start chat button and the AI will do the rest. And in this video, I'm planning to create a tool to help me with my content creation needs. For example, let's say I'm a YouTuber and I'm planning to create an AI tool that will help me create AI powered thumbnails. So thumbnails using AI. And also I, I should be able to give my video idea and the AI should be able to suggest some really cool title and description ideas. So these two are the basic tools that I want within the platform that I'm about to build. So what I'll do is I'll start by giving a prompt something like this. And it says I want to build a tool to help me with YouTube channel management and content creations. And it will have two features. The first one is AI thumbnail generator. So a feature where I can enter a prompt and the AI will generate a YouTube thumbnail based on that particular prompt. And for image generation, I plan to use Google's Gemini 2.5 flash image model. So I'm explicitly mentioning that I want to use the Nano Banana model, which is Gemini 2.5 Flash. And again, the title and description generator tool, a feature that provides multiple YouTube titles and descriptions based on the information I input. And again, I also explicitly mentioned that we will use OpenAI GPT-5 AI model for this. And you know what the interesting thing is? I'm not going to get any API keys or I'm not going to juggle between the Google AI Studio or the developer account of OpenAI or nothing as such. I just have to mention the AI model that I want to use, hit enter and I can get going and Replit itself will use these AI models without me even having to go through any OAuth flow or even grabbing my API keys. I'll show you how. So this right here is the initial prompt I'll begin with and now I'll click on the start chat button right here. So let's wait. So it says creating app. There you go. It says I'll help you create a YouTube channel management tool with AI powered thumbnail generation and title slash description generation. Okay. And now towards the bottom, it says confirm Gemini integration. And as you can see, it says add Gemini to your app using Replit's managed service. No API keys required and charges are billed to your credits. And now all I have to do is to click on this approve button right here. And that's it. Now Replit will automatically use Gemini and do everything and all the configuration, all the setup, API, everything will be managed by Replit itself. And again, in the second tool that is for title and description generator, we wanted to use GPT-5 AI model. And now it is asking, add open AI to your app using Replit managed service, no API keys required and charges are built to your credits. And again, I'll click on approve. And now Replit has come up with a plan to build our app and we can find all the information in here. So as you can see in the integration section, it says Gemini and also open AI. And again, they're managed by Replit by the way. And here I can find all the features that I asked for and pretty much everything looks good. So if you want to change anything, you can click on this change plan option right here. But for the time being, everything looks good to me. And again, here I have two options. So the first one is that you can ask Replit to build the entire app for you and it will take over 20 minutes. And if you select this option right here, you can sit back and relax and the AI will come up with a final version of the app that is fully working with all the features incorporated right into it. And again, you also have an option that says start with a design. 
and it is best if you want to see a design prototype first then iterate on visuals or features so if you want to build alongside ai and if you want to review all the design and all that and then iteratively build you can select the second option now in this case i want the full app so i'll select the first option that says build the entire app and now i'll click on start building okay there you go the ai has started working on the same and now it will take some time for the ai to build the app because we literally asked the ai to build the entire app in one go so all you have to do is to sit back and relax while the ai does its thing so i'll wait for some time and i'll see you afterwards all right so there you go here we have the finished version of the app ready and as you can see it says youtube creator ai studio ai powered youtube tools and in the initial prompt that we gave, we asked the AI to incorporate two features that is AI powered thumbnail generation and then title and description generators. And I can find both of these tools in this particular page and towards the top, I can find a button. Okay. We even have dark mode enabled. Okay. That's actually good. And yet another interesting thing that I found is that after creating the initial version of the app, the Replit agent itself went ahead and tested the entire app to make sure that every features work. And this right here is the finished app. And next up, just as to make sure that all the features work, I'll start by giving a prompt to generate a thumbnail and it says a dramatic thumbnail for a YouTube video explaining the history of Apple, the tech giant. And now I'll click on generate thumbnail and let's see, it says generating. Okay, there you go. Apple, a tech odyssey, the garage revolution to global empire. And here we have the thumbnail ready. Okay, so the thumbnail generation feature is indeed working. And if I click on this download thumbnail option, as you can see here, we can even download the generated thumbnail in full quality as well. Okay, so that works. That's cool. So the thumbnail generation functionality is working. And next step, we can go ahead and give a video topic or content idea. For example, let's say a YouTube video explaining the history of Apple and I can just let's put it as a uh, casual and target audience. I will leave it as it is. And now I can click on generate titles and descriptions and let's see. And there you go. Here we have the title and descriptions from garage to iPhone, the wild history of Apple, then Apple's origin story, jobs, Macs, and moments that change tech. So as you can see here, we have the titles and description. And along with that, we also have this copy button as well. So pretty much all the functionalities that I wanted is already live in this particular app. And next up, if you want to make any changes or add any new features, well, all you have to do is to just explain that to Replit AI agent in this input box right here. And next up, let's just say I want to add authentication into a app such that the user should be able to sign in and sign up on our platform. Well, all I have to do is to give a prompt in here and you can replicate already have authentication and, you know, databases and all other stuff baked into it. So you don't have to rely on external tools or let's say third party services like Superbase. All you have to do is to give a prompt, something like this. Please add full fledged user authentication into a app such that the user is able to sign in and sign up on our app. And now all I have to do is to click on the send button. And there you go. As you can see, Replit has started working on adding user authentication into our app. And again, towards the top, I can now find an option that says tools and files. And if I click on the same, I'll be able to find a bunch of tools. For example, let's say if you want to integrate your app with some other tools or let's say third party services. For that, if I click on this option that says integrations, I'll be able to find all these tools that I can integrate my tool with. For example, here we have connector section and as you can see, these are first party integrations that Replit support and here you can find a bunch of them including Asana, Box, Confluence, Discord, Dropbox, GitHub, a variety of Google products, HubSpot, Linear, Notion, YouTube. I mean, you can just click on this particular button and integrate this particular app into your, the app that you're actually building. That's one cool feature right within Replit and not just that, you can publish your app, you can configure app storage and right now we are building and incorporating auth and you can find authentication related data in here and right now we don't really have any users yet but after the implementation you'll be able to find all the user data in there and here we have a bunch of other tools as well which you can explore and in which case now i'll wait for the ai to add authentication and i'll see you afterwards all right so there you go now authentication is added and right now when we visit our website this is the kind of interface that we will see and i can find the sneak peek of both tools that are available within the app and i can find a sign in button and a get started free button and if i click on one of these button it takes me to a testing page and now you can only log in with your account in the preview window okay i'll click on login I'll just click on allow. So after you publish the app, it will be easy for you to log in. But in which ways, let me try to log in. 
and there you go i'm now logged in and towards the top you can find my email address and you can configure your app to use google login github login or email and password you name it you have options for that and now if i click on tools and files and if i go to auth section right here as you can see here i have the user that i just created so pretty much everything works and yeah this is how simple it is to create an AI powered app without juggling between the developer account documentation api keys back and forth switching between tools and tabs that none of these are needed anymore all you have to do is to just explain the app idea and also tell the ai that you want to use this particular ai model from this company hit enter and that's pretty much it and the ai will go ahead and build the entire app just like what you saw right now and after you're done building the app if you want to publish the same and deploy it and make it live on the internet towards the top you will find a button that says publish and i can click on the same and now all i have to do is to give this particular app a name in this case i'll give it a name that says tube forge and i can click on publish and right now it will be under the subdomain of replit.app but if you have a custom domain you have the option to publish it under your own custom domain as well so which is also very cool and the thing is that Replit is your one-stop solution for building any kind of app from the initial ideation to creating the app to adding features, adding database authentication and finally even deploying the same. And now if you are a non-technical person then managing and handling all these DevOps stuff and actually deploying your app to the internet can be very time consuming, very hectic and tiring at the same time. But all thanks to the deployment feature right within Replit, within just a single click, you can make your app live on the internet. And once you connect your custom domain, you have a fully branded and fully ready app ready to roll. And that's how simple it is. And right now the build process is in progress and within seconds, the app will be deployed and we should be able to access it using the link that they provide. In which way, let's wait for it. There you go. The deployment is now complete and I can try to visit the same. And there you go. And I can click on get started free. And once I'm logged in, I can access both of these tools that we have within our platform. For example, let's say professional tech review thumbnail, click on generate thumbnail and let's see. There you go. Here we have the thumbnail and pretty much everything works. And again, as I mentioned earlier, if you want to connect a custom domain, you can do that. And if you want to purchase a new domain, you can do that right within Replit as well. You can go ahead and search for a domain, purchase it and directly add it as well. And now that's pretty much all I wanted to show you in today's video. And if you're someone who is planning to build an AI powered app with some kind of AI integrations or AI features, look no other than Replit. So click the first link in the description below, head over to replit.com, sign up for a new account and make use of the new AI integrations to build faster than ever. And now I hope you guys found this video useful. If yes, make sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.